The mannequins were imported from India and it was supplied by a company in Bombay. They were incredibly heavy, <laughs> probably heavier than myself or a tall grown man. They were really, really heavy. What I kind of find interesting about it is that, um, first of all, you see that the mannequin spinning and her beautiful, beautiful dress. And then you start to listen and you start hearing the voices and you hear about some of the stories, um, some of the stories about people's attitudes to wearing saris. The real sari business started in 1968. I remember when I was young, we used to run around them when they were in the window. I love the film Mughal Azam very much. Whenever I feel time, I just see that. You know, once a month or twice a month, I always look at it. And I guess what I've enjoyed most about it is just sitting and watching and watching people walk past and stopping and looking. All kinds of people, people who I don't think would normally go and see art, have obviously been really intrigued by it. And it's really nice to see something where people don't feel afraid to just go and go and have a look and, and learn something maybe, or just have an experience which they wouldn't normally have walking through the market on a Saturday.